if you are a naturalista, if you have natural hair, you guys know the struggle of trying to wear a hat with your natural hair. It just does not work. So in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all how to wear a hat with your natural hair, like how to get it right, get it tight. Hola beauties, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Morenia and today I'm gonna show y'all how to get that hat on that head. So you're just gonna need a couple of things. You're gonna need spray bottle filled with water, some gel or a creamy product, and then a brush. Essential. Uh, as you can see, my hair is in no condition to have a hat on. And what sucks about being natural, like we try to wear hats. Well, just people, people wear hats, if not for fashion, for when they're having hard hair days, like horrid hair days. Like you're having a horrible hair day, that's where you want, that's when you want to wear a hat. And for us, it's not as simple as just throwing the cap on because the way our texture is set up, it just doesn't. It just doesn't mesh. Like, it just doesn't happen. So, we have to go in with the water. Well, first, I always part my hair. And I always do, like, a really deep, 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 deep part. Like, all the way. Don't judge me. My hair's dirty, okay? But um, I always do, like, a deep, 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 deep part like that. And then you just go in and spray the sides of your hair. Like, the, the top part, not the back. I use quite a bit of water when I do this. So now that we have saturated the top half of our head, we're just gonna rub in that water. And if you want, if your hair is feeling dry, go ahead and just spray your ends. Give it some life, give it some moisture. Oh, I forgot. One other thing you definitely need is a hair tie, but it's kind of a given, you need a scrunch. So, when your hair is all wet and such, you go ahead with your gel and remember it doesn't have to be perfect because we're putting a cap on it but we go in with our gel and we just smooth the hair down we just smooth the hair down okay okay so you just smooth it like so literally just raking this through the hair <laughs> and what you do with your brush i like to use the soft side first i just go in and I just smooth down my edges because I hate nothing more. Sorry, you guys, I did not shave my armpits. I apologize. But what I hate more than anything is when um, I see a girl with a cap on and her edges look so dusty. It's like, sweetie poo, we're not about to rock the natural nation like that. We're not about to embarrass the collective in such a manner. And then I go in with the rough side after I use the soft side, I go in with the rough. If you only have like a one-sided brush, it's no big deal. Just use that one side. But for this type of brush, this is what I like to do. And remember, I'm not trying to get it perfect, like slick down edges, like a really sleek, sleek bun. Because, you know, the cap's going to be on it. But I want my edges to look right because you can still see your edges when you have the cap on. So you take the hair... And you have the scrunchie on one hand, whichever hand you use. And you go into the low pone. You go into the low pone in the back. You take the scrunch. And you put your hair in that low pony. And you make the cutest bun. And fluff. Cute bun. Cute pimple. Alrighty. So we have it like that. Honestly, you can leave your hair like this if you wanted to. You know, just in a nice, slicky, slicky bun. I, I just feel like wearing a hat today because my hair is so filthy. <sighs> my hair is filthy. And then I just take my Big Up Jamaica hat and put it on my head. Like you would normally. And it's as simple as that. Right. If I have any baby hairs in the back, I like to brush those up. But it looks like they're not acting on their own accord today, so we're fine. So, this is how we do it. This is how we do it. Mm -hmm. This is how we do it. Ah, nah, 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 nah. It's Friday night. It's not Friday. <laughs> 
is Monday. It's a school day. And here you have it. How to put a cap on natural hair. And I know you guys, some of you may think, oh, that's so simple. But trust me, when I was starting out, when I first cut off all my hair to become natural, it was really hard for me because I had to adapt from, okay, having a perm. When I had bad hair days with a perm, I would just throw on a cap. And it wasn't that simple when I was natural. And I do have other tips and tricks when I have bad hair days because sometimes a cap is not appropriate for work or what have you, or school could not wear, I mean, college is fine but if you're in high school middle school whatever you can't wear a cap to school for like security safety reasons so if you guys want another video on what to do when you're having a really really rough natural day and you just can't wear the hair as so just let me know in the comments below or like this video and i'll make more videos showing you guys how to like you know make your natural hair look like it's amazing because I'm the queen of that because my hair always looks like trash. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Like this video. It helps me out a bunch. And share this video if you have like another, if you're not natural but you have a natural sister in your life or a natural brother. Uh, send them this video. It's like really simple and short and sweet. Um, but yeah, I love you guys so much. Besitos. Bye.